Some very big news for Samsung One UI 7 really arrived yesterday, guys. Now, I don't know how, but on ABK Mirror, the Home App version 16001 has appeared. A lot of you, included myself, tried to install it, didn't really work, so we have to check some things on the APK. Now, for sure, this APK requires Android 15. Android 15 Vanilla Ice Cream, you can see it from here, Target SDK, so you can modify it in any way, then still be able to install it. So yes, you can still install the application, but of course, because this is still in the working and it does really require Android 15, although you can install it, guys, it's not going to run in a proper way, but we were able to extract some very vital information. Now, first, let me show you, if I go from here, right, 100% sure, this is the version 16001. So then, with Activity Launcher, there are some things that really do our attention. For example, bottom gesture sensitivity setting, this was there before. Home gesture animation tuning, this was there before. The interpolator, the large folder settings, though, all interesting. So you can try to start those activities, but it's not gonna work because they are locked. It requires privileged access. But thanks to my man, Ujval, I was able to get some screenshots and the news indeed is huge so let me just start sharing with you home gesture animation tuning we have now options unseen before we have large folders we have also the option to set the animation curve so if all of this is really true and i think it is and if it's implemented well we might as well see one of the smoothest one uis ever let's check this one here home gesture animation tuning Pixel by pixel, enjoy the feeling of pure animation. I mean, this sounds promising, right? The scent of a certain fruit. Feel the sweet taste of the red fruit. Simple tuning, fast or emotionally, your choice. And then guys, you do have this indicator, emotionally to the left, fast to the right. Advanced tuning. Gesture tuning settings can only be home gestures in swipe from sides and bottom gesture settings. Advanced tuning requires various attempts. So guys, so much more. This is the advanced tuning. You can apparently set up a damping. You can change the damping of the icon move animation. The smaller it is, the greater the elasticity. Stiffness. You can change the stiffness of the icon move animation. The larger the value, the faster it moves. Friction. You can change the friction of the icon move animation. The larger, right, the faster it stops. So imagine all of these settings customizable via home map via good luck i believe that one ui 7 is going to be on the next level of customization probably even unseen in a stock mobile os without routing and etc you have damping also for the icon scale just imagine what you can do and of course there is even more there is tracking position you can also change the tracking position the larger the value it targets top position of the icon scale you can also change the maximum scale of the wallpaper animation this i believe is really like my favorite effect going in and out when you just open and close an app scale duration of the wallpaper animation and the unit is in seconds so i guess you can probably go to at least two seconds this really looks so promising but let me show you show you a bit more this is the so-called interpolator and this is absolutely insane this allows you somehow to change the curve of the animation all right so we have x1 we have y1 x2 and y2 and this is used to adjust the horizontal and vertical changes in the size of an icon so x represents the horizontal change of the icon of course and then we have y that represents the vertical change and these values are involved at the beginning of the animation with the values x2 and y2 are involved in the latter part of the animation so as the value increases there will be a relatively faster change and the thing is, you can move this around and adjust this. It is absolutely insane. Now, large folder. So many other Androids, like the HypeOS, like the ColorOS. I believe most of them, they have it. So now One UI 7 will most probably have a regular folder, like then a small, medium, and large with adjustable settings, such as the folder grid, the icon size. It is absolutely insane, guys. From what I see, the One UI 7 is going to be really a huge update. And thanks, Usval, one more time for be able to run those screenshots, because again, privileged access already is required, and allowing me to share them in this video, guys. So for now, don't try to install the APK. It's just not going to work. You can most probably only get to the settings. We have to wait until we get our hands on the first One UI 7 beta. I am really so hyped right now. Thank you guys so much for watching VST. Over and bye.